I'm Ian Hill, founder of OzPost International. Today we're going to build this deck with the OzDeck system. The OzDeck system utilizes a floating deck technique. Floating decks are common throughout North America and, have, and is an excellent system for building your deck. And this is basically how the system works. The main difference with the floating deck and other deck construction techniques is a floating deck is not attached to your structure. This could be your home right here, or you can have it out in the middle of your yard. In general, OzDeck is suitable for decks no higher than eight feet off the ground. You'll also want to space your OzDecks no more than seven feet in any direction. Now I'd like to explain some of the parts of a deck. First, you've got your foundation. This is your Oz deck plate. Then in through the deck plate, you drive the OzPost T4850. Then you have your post your saddle bracket, your saddle bracket attaches the post to the beam. The beam is two two by eights laminated together. On top of the beam rests your joist back here. The perimeter of the deck is called a rim joist. Then we have your deck boards, Oz railing, railing post, and pickets. I'd now like to review the tools you'll need for your deck project. This is a standard list of tools for the deck we're building. You may need additional tools if you have a customized deck. The OzHammer OH01 is the special driver that fits into the jackhammer. You will also need a hammer spacer, HSP T4. The hammer spacer is simply an adapter for the OzHammer that fits the T4850 OzPost that we're driving today. Level. The most efficient level to use for driving Oz posts is a strap-on post level like this one. They are cost effective and work very well. Post levels are available at any hardware store. You can also use a small spirit level, but these are not as efficient. Safety equipment, goggles, ear protection, work boots, pants and gloves. 10 inch spikes. 36 inch driving stake. String line line level, measuring tape, plumb bob, hammer, drill, saw, pencil or marker, square, inch and a quarter hole saw, drill bits, ratchet, sockets and wrenches, five pound hammer.